I'm here with Australia's Jamie Malarkey. He fights Devontae Smith this weekend. Jamie, it has been six months since you've last fought. How great does it feel to be in Vegas, be in fight week and preparing to fight in the next couple of days? Feeling good. Feeling uh, it's been a long time coming, uh, a bit too long for my liking. So I'm very excited to get back in there this weekend. I know a lot of other Australian fighters have had some issues with being able to train properly. There's minimal flights in and out of the country. Is that something that you kind of had to deal with? Uh, were there any problems because of that for this fight camp? Um, a little bit in and out before my camp started. Yeah, there's a couple of obstacles to overcome. So, um, yeah, just... But luckily, we got a travel exemption and we got an exemption to uh, train and get it done. That's uh, the most perfect scenario that you could get. Uh, I know you had a little bit of a rough start to your tenure in the UFC, but your last fight, you had a beautiful first round knockout of a very highly touted prospect in Karma Worthy. How amazing did that feel to finally get your hand raised under the UFC banner? Yeah, it felt good. It felt um, just reassured me that I belong here and uh, just looking to keep that momentum going and get another first round finish. <laughs> That's the uh, first round finishes is what everybody wants, but you are fighting a very tough opponent in Devontae Smith. And when you look at his record on paper, it is very impressive. He's got a lot of stoppages, a lot of first round finishes, but you and I both know <laughs> styles make fights have you watched a lot of footage do you know much about him in preparation for this fight and how do you see this one going yeah we've watched some footage and um we've got a good game plan coming into this fight um he does have an impressive resume um i've got a, a very high finish rate as well so i think that's why they match just together for an exciting fight um i don't think he's as battle tested as me though uh, i don't think he's had as stiff competition so mm -hmm. Um, I think he's going to be in for a little bit of a shock when he, when he feels my pressure and he feels my, my presence in the ring. That's certainly something that you have to gain through experience and you definitely have that experience. You've been through a lot of wars, but you both have an opponent in common. You both have fought Karma Worthy. And do you take confidence going into this fight knowing you've stopped the guy who stopped him? Is that something you think about? Do you process that? Do you let that kind of affect anything uh, in going into this fight? Um, yes and no. Like, I think it might be playing on his mind a little bit, but in my mind, this is a new fight. Um, I can't really go off uh, what's happened in the past, um, but I have watched that footage. Uh, I'm, I'm picking up on, the, on his little tendencies and um we've got a we've got a really good game plan coming into this fight and I'm, I'm very confident you gotta love that confidence and like you said you were battle tested i watched a promo video that you put up on your social media and you said that you train for everything and you are always prepared for a war as a fight fan you have to love that type of energy coming from a fighter do you envision this fight being a war i know Devonte is necessarily a faster starter do you see him trying to push the pace early um, I don't, to be honest. I see it being a, a bit more of a technical battle. Um, I'm going to have to figure him out in there and I, I'm, I'm confident in the game plan that we've got and I'm confident in my preparation. So um, I'm not sure. what We, we don't know what's going to happen in there. We never know. But um, I'm very confident that I'm going to have my hand raised at the end of the fight. And that's the confidence that you need. You are also a training partner of featherweight champion Alexander Volkanovsky. He, everyone's talking about his fight from this past weekend against Brian Ortega. How happy are you to see him retain the belt, bring it back to Australia again? And do you take, you know, confidence and inspiration from that going into your own fight this weekend? Yeah, hundred um, percent. I was actually on the plane when. He thought I was. Uh, unfortunately, I missed the fight, but I knew. I knew. I, I was. I was pretty confident myself in um, how he was going to go. And when I landed, I landed to uh, good news. And I do. I take a lot of confidence in that because um, I was right beside him doing every single session, and we've 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 pushed hard for this fight. Um, I, I've I've never had the the confidence in my 
uh, conditioning my gas tank, um, training with that guy is just a, a different beast. Well, you both are beasts inside of the cage, Jamie Malaki. Good luck this weekend against Devontae Smith. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.